There, we've got it. We're rocking. We're rolling. Yeah. We're we're live. Everything. Are we filming? All cameras are recording. Hi, everybody. Hi, Robin. Hey, Brian Cusco. How's it going? I am burning at both ends. <laughs> yeah, that's how the weekend goes, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, so, hey, Brian, I wanted to show you our new deli cup. I'm seeing it up close and personal. Yeah. In the grand scheme of things, deli cups, not very exciting. But in the shipping world, uh, I'm actually pretty stoked about this thing. Did we not show these in North Carolina? Well, we probably took a look at them. Okay. But now I have them in stock and available on the website. Gotcha. At redlineshipping.com. Okay. Um, so the great thing about this is it's perfectly sized for shipping boxes. So this particular deli cup uh, fits perfectly in the 666 box, which is one of the most common shipping boxes. And you can stack them too high. In the 776 box, uh, you can fit it three oh. of these in there. And it's a great size for like baby ball pythons, which also makes it easy size for baby colubrids or even juvenile colubrids. Um, also popular like in the spider world, tarantulas, uh, spider stuff. Uh, also popular with the isopod folks and doing like, you know, a soil substrate with bugs and such inside. Yeah. Um, but actually, I have one of the 776 boxes. And I can, you can see how it fits uh, three wide plus a phase pack in the oh, 776. Yeah. So it, the idea was to make it a, a perfect size that maximizes the space inside the shipping box. And we also have space for the face pack as well in there. Um, so the, these are in stock now. We did, it's taken us probably a year plus to get the mold done, uh, you know, tweak it, make sure the lid fits nice and snug, uh, have everything work uh, together well. But yeah, the, we have them just in stock, just in time for the Tinley show this year and uh, available on the site now. So I just wanted to check them out. Yeah, awesome. Well, I'm definitely getting some for ball python shipping for sure. I mean, I, I like bags, but I like the idea of them having an uncrushable, slightly more protection. Right? Yeah, for the smaller species, uh, it can be helpful because it, it does prevent any kind of crushing or smashing. Yeah, especially if you're packing multiple. And if you're doing multiple animals in a box, yeah. That uh, structural integrity of, of something like that deli cup uh, comes in handy for sure. Totally. Awesome. Thanks. Thank you. Good enough? Yeah, it's great. Something you can use? Yeah, for sure. All right. Who's the best interview of the day? Or the weekend, sorry. Um, really? Okay. Yeah. Um, nice. Best? Gosh. Uh, just one stands out from the others, or they're all just good and consistent? They were all pretty good. Um, I want to say there was, there was one that was, I mean, Patrick Holmes, um, Texas Condros. That was, that was a really good one. Like, it, okay. was, it was very... Um, like kind of deep, um, but also Reggie. Reggie's got pretty deep as well. So, like personal stuff. Yeah. Really. Okay. Interesting. I'm also going to get a nice close tight shot with this thing. You have four angles. Oh, just for my nails. Yeah. Just for your nails. Yeah. That's all that this shot's about, is just strictly for your nails. 